It's a children's Elvis anecdote. Uh, one night I come off stage, and Elvis is in the wings, and he said, I've got this song, Tom. You know, I got this song. So I said, well, Elvis, I got to jump in the shower. You know, I'll be right there. I'm in the shower and I'm uh, washing my hair. Just pretend. And I can hear Elvis Presley's voice. I'm holding you. And I'm, I'm thinking, my God, I must be going nuts because Elvis I can hear Presley. Elvis Presley's voice in the shower. So and I, I open my eyes and there's Elvis leaning over the door singing this song to me. And I said, well, Elvis, look, you know, I... It sounds great, but, I, you know, can I just get out of the shower? And he said, uh, yeah, sure, man, you know, come on. I come out, <laughs> and I'm coupling down, and he's still singing this song to me. But it, apparently it looked like he had already used the toilet because he had this North Beach leather outfit on, and his pants were still around his ankles. So there I am naked, <laughs> you know, toweling down, and he's there with these with these trousers around his, his ankles, still singing to me. And he said, what do you think? I said, yeah, great. I said, but you haven't put your pants up yet. You know, and he said, what? I said, your, your pants are still around your ankles. So he shouts for Red West, Red! You know, and Red bumps him through the door. My pants, man, my pants. And he goes, oh, <laughs> So Red West is on his knees pulling these pants up Elvis's legs. And uh, so he's pulling him up, and Red is on his knees, and he's looking at me. He said, "If you told this story to anybody, they wouldn't believe you." I'm right there with you, and I.